Hi there. Happy International Women's Day to all the married women out there. So you know that in this video I'm going to be addressing all the married women and encouraging them to take charge of their money. I have always believed that women inherently possesses the managing skills and the emotional competence that is required to make good investing decisions, especially in times of turbulence or stress. I have personally experienced this with my mother who's a homemaker and didn't know anything about finances until her mid 40s but took the reins of our family's finances because of my father's ill health and certain other circumstances so she is a woman who would blindly sign checks or documents that my father would get and today 15 years later she has a retirement plan set not only for herself and my father but probably certain inheritances for me and my sister yes she had the support of her advisors her ca and many other people along the way to help her set this plan but she learned a lot she took the charge of her finances and started making those decisions but she started doing all these things only when life threw such a situation at her where she had no other choice but to do this through this video i want to encourage you all that please don't wait for that one curve ball or that one disaster to take charge of your finances but do it from today so please do watch this video as i'm going to give you some suggestions which will help you understand your and your family's finances better This is Akriti Agarwal and in today's video we are going to give you certain suggestions which you can use to start taking care of your and your family's finances. The first thing that you must do is start talking about it, right? So have a conversation with your spouse and discuss the various aspects of your money. So the first thing that you can do is sit with them and understand what's the family's income like how much you are making how much they are earning how many bank accounts you have and where is the money being spent we are sure that you would have a decent control of the family's expenses so this should not be a difficult start once this is taken care of the next thing you can do is understand about investments talk to your spouse and know where is he investing money and where you are investing money sit together and discuss about your goals what are the things that you wish to invest for and how are you going to achieve these goals one of the most important things after investments is your insurances like covid has given a reality check to most of us right so if someone gets a health issue or is there an untimely death where are the insurance documents kept who is the person you should approach to in such a situation so insurance should also be covered in that manner and the most important thing is understand the debt are there any loans that your spouse has taken from where the loans are taken and what is the repayment plan i personally have seen a lot of women struggle with settling debt so please don't be in that position understand about family's debt and discuss if you are comfortable with the same or not be open about what you think of these things now apart from understanding various financial aspects certain things that you must know of is have a directory of all the people your family reaches out to for any financial things such as your chartered accountant advisors agents insurance agents if there is a meeting that your spouse is having with them next time accompany him so you know that person and you know if ever you need any help you can reach out to them directly and the last bit which is extremely important is that ensure that you are the joint account holder or the nominee for all the investments and bank accounts this will ensure that if anything were to happen to your spouse you can manage the finances without any worry we know that for some of you this could be a difficult discussion because you know you probably have never done this or it's not something that comes naturally to you but that is what taking charge of your finances is all about right approach your spouses set a money date if you want to and start discussing about these things maybe small steps would lead to them also developing that confidence in you and giving you more control of your 
finances just like your spouse has an opinion about how much salt should be there in your food you can also develop an opinion on where the money should be invested and how the finances should be managed the entire idea is that get started have that conversation and take charge of your money if you think of any women who would benefit from this video then please do share this video with them and don't forget to like share and subscribe to our channel and watch out this space every wednesdays and saturdays as we bring freshly brewed content only for you and once again have a great women's day and we hope that you use this day to not only shop but also learn better about your finances